Holy Cross at Prayer for April 2nd, 2021. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Truly, truly, I say to you, unless a grain of wheat falls into the earth and dies, it remains alone. But if it, if it dies, it bears much fruit. And a reading from Hebrews chapter 4. Since then we have a great high priest who has passed through the heavens, Jesus the Son of God, let us hold fast our confession. For we do not have a high priest who is unable to sympathize with our weaknesses, but one who in every respect has been tempted as we are, yet without sin. Let us then with confidence draw near to the throne of grace, that we may receive mercy and find grace to help in time of need. The throne of grace. That is a nice ring to it, doesn't it? We come before the throne of grace because the graceful one has gone before us, cleansed us with his blood, and presented us to the Father whole and without spot or blemish. We need never be afraid of bringing our every need before the throne of God because it is a throne of grace, and Jesus Christ has made a place for us there. Let us pray. Father, we lift up Jack before you this day, asking that you would give him your mercy all the days of his life. Through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Almighty God, graciously behold this your family, for whom our Lord Jesus Christ was willing to be betrayed and delivered into the hands of sinful men to suffer death upon the cross. Through the same Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever, Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Amen.